Fernando Antigua was an assistant to that man for many years. Started at Memphis, came with him to Kentucky. Now he's running his own show at the University of South Florida in Tampa and coaching the Dominican Republic national team. And now we'll see if John Robick makes any change in the lineup just for defensive purposes. He's got a, a solid defensive lineup out there. But to have Tyler Eulis on the ball, you would think that Marcus Lee and Carl Towns are going to stay out there. And then the Harrison twins. <laughs> Coach Cal obviously not happy about something he just saw. Might have been a little coaching going on from the stands there. Illegal in tennis, not so in basketball. Eulis will be key here in putting pressure on the ball. And you have to watch out for second shots as well. You know, a defensive rebound can end it. But so can an offensive rebound for the Dominican. Coronado has it, guarded by Eulis. Gets it to Martinez. Now it's Vargas. Well, Eulis stayed step for step with Coronado. Martinez with five. Fall away. Got it. Two seconds. Well, there's far more time than point four. There's over two seconds to go. When that shot went through, there was there was two seconds on the clock. And the clock should stop. But it didn't. Jack Martinez with about a 13-foot fall away jumper. And Andrew Harrison on him. And that's just a difficult shot to put pressure on. There was a, there was at least two seconds when that ball went through. Yeah, three, 